Hello and welcome to another Pi presentation video. Now, <clears throat> I personally am a big favorite of uh, Chrisville pipes. Uh, any series, any handmade series, vintage ones, of course. This one is a uh, Chrisville Bernadotte. Just, uh, just the lighting a bit. There we go. I need a bit more space, so like that. Chrisville Bernadotte, handmade Denmark, and we have the shape code 1812 on the bottom. Uh, I said it's a chimney because ball is tall, you can just say stacked. It has that oval uh, bottom with a pointy uh, top or bottom, depending how you look. A triangular uh, shank and stem with soft transition and edges, unfiltered. logo has faded but it's still there you can see um, no bite marks balconite stem beautiful condition um, crisp chamber walls nice and clean rim edge thinner walls as you can see uh, deep chamber I had a question from a gentleman on eBay um, and I took a photo with flash on um, of the uh, drilling which was done on dead center and um, there was a question if the pipe will overheat considering that uh, walls are thin. Well the thing about that with uh, older pipes such as this one you know back in the day they oh, usually made thin prior pipes, you know, and um, if it was a question of overheating, we would not we would not be reselling those pipes or people would not be collecting them because they would all have been burned by now. So that's not the case if you smoke it like a normal person should. If you chug on it, if you, you know, take straight Virginia and um, or some blend with rich in Virginia, and you chug it like a maniac, it's gonna overheat. Is it gonna burn? Again, it depends on you. You can burn uh, a cheap pipe, you can burn a premium brand prop pipe if you're just uh, not following any sort of guidelines or simple logic. If you smoke it normally, this pipe will not overheat. It might be a bit warmer, yes, but overheat not, or you can just always take a break if you uh, were chugging a bit too strong. Um, considering how good, how light it is, how good Briar is, um, and the drilling and the finish and simply crystal pipes known for their quality, this pipe should smoke like a charm and it's one beautiful, beautiful vintage piece. Um, so that will be all for this short presentation. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next one.